Action movies are a staple of pop culture and often have badass tough guys or girls as their main characters. Although it's easy to dismiss these movies as nothing more than over-the-top flicks utilizing actors with no pugilistic skill, you'd be surprised at the number of actors with backgrounds in the martial arts. From favorites like Chris Hemsworth and Keanu Reeves to classic Hollywood tough guys like Dolph Lundgren, here are actors you never knew were also fighters. First up in our video, we'll be covering a classic classic baddie from Hollywood, Dolph Lundgren. Lundgren is known for his role in such movies as Men of War and other movies like Silent Trigger. Perhaps his most famous role ever is as Ivan Drago from Rocky and the Creed series. Lundgren prepared for his role in Rocky IV with several months of both boxing and strength training. He doesn't just portray fighters, however, as Lundgren actually has a black belt in Kyokushin Karate. Lundgren has studied karate since he was a child, as his father constantly pushed Lundgren to be better and better. Just like Lundgren, Wesley Snipes is another famous actor for one particular role, that being his performance in Marvel's Blade. Snipes has also starred in plenty of other action movies like Jungle Fever and New York Jack, but no movie showcases his martial arts skills better than Blade. Snipes has a background in several different martial arts. He studied kickboxing and BJJ. Snipes has also trained at places like USA Shaolin Temple where he studied Kung Fu and has also trained under masters such as Mestre Gilon Vieira, who taught Snipes Koperia. The actor has been training since the age of 12, but he began to study karate and Hapkido, both of which he holds a black belt in. Up next, Jean-Claude Van Damme. No list of actors with fighting skills would be complete without mentioning another Hollywood classic, Jean-Claude Van Damme. The Belgian is known for both his physique as well as his fighting prowess. Van Damme has been training in martial arts since he was 10. When he first began to study Shotokan Karate, by age 18 he was a black belt. Van Damme has trained with national teams and competed professionally in martial arts. Van Damme has studied a variety of different fighting styles, including Mai Tai, Karate, Kickboxing, and Taekwondo. His acting career actually stemmed from his fighting career, as he was originally cast in movies specifically for his fighting abilities. Another actor who has competed professionally in fights is Mickey. Mickey Rourke, known for his roles in movies like Diner, Rumble Fish, Wrestler, and Barfly. Rourke had been a boxer in his younger years, but switched from the sweet science to pursue a career in acting. After Barfly, though, he transitioned back into boxing. Although he didn't have the longest boxing career, he still has a respectable record of eight wins, two draws, with six knockouts to his name. Rourke retired from boxing in 1994 before returning to the world of acting. Now, Chuck Norris. Chuck Norris has a legendary reputation and is regarded by many as among the most badass tough guys that have ever existed. Chuck Norris has a very successful career in both acting and in martial arts and is actually the inventor of his own style of martial arts, Chung Kuk Do. Chuck Norris was originally an airman and enlisted in the Air Force back in 1958 where he was stationed in Korea and began studying Tang Soo Do before creating his own style. Chuck Norris holds a black belt in Tang Soo Do, Chung Kuk Do, Taekwondo, Karate, BJJ, and Judo. He also holds the distinction of being the first Westerner to become a Grand Master in Taekwondo, when he was awarded the 8th degree black belt in 1990. The next actor on our list is definitely someone you wouldn't expect to be a fighter, Keanu Reeves. Keanu Reeves has had a long and extensive career in acting, working on both action and non-action films. Some of his most notable works include Bill and Ted's Excellent Adventure, John Wick, and the Matrix. Although Reeves doesn't have as much fighting experience as someone like Van Damme, the actor has still trained in a variety of different styles, including boxing, jiu-jitsu, Krav Maga, karate, wushu, and judo. Next we have John Fu. John Fu may be an unfamiliar name to some, but he's an actor with both plenty of talent in acting as well as physical prowess in martial arts. Fu has starred in a similar smaller roles and is early into his acting career, with his most notable role being his current performance as Detective Lee in Rush Hour. 
Fu has been a martial arts artist since the age of eight, when he first began to study Kung Fu and Judo. By the time he was 15, he began to train more seriously in Wushu. So far, we've covered several different actors you probably didn't know had a background in martial arts. It seems like the best action movie actors, whether from past movies or current, have knowledge in martial arts. There's still plenty more actors we have yet to discuss though, so keep watching to learn about even more actors you didn't know were fighting. Next on our list is Idris Elba, best known for his work with Chris Hemsworth as Heimdall in the Marvel Cinematic Universe. Elba is a kickboxer and a good one at that. The actor utilizes kickboxing to help maintain his physique and to help his fight scenes on screen. Elba, however, is also a professional kickboxer. He's only had a single fight professionally against Dutch kickboxer Lionel Graves. In the first round, however, Elba managed to land a knockout against the more experienced Graves, proving his fighting potential. And now, Chris Hemsworth. Chris Hemsworth certainly needs no introduction. The actor is internationally famous for his portrayal of the North God of Thunder, Thor, in the Marvel Cinematic Universe. Known for his incredible physique and athletic talent, Hemsworth is no slouch when it comes to fighting either. The Australian is a fan of MMA and some striking arts and utilizes Mai Tai and boxing to maintain and improve his fitness and physique. Up next, Mario Lopez. Mario Lopez Lopez is an actor who's known for his work on several television shows. Since 1996, he's been a mainstay on the series Access Hollywood, but his most famous role began in 1989 when he was cast as A.C. Slater in Saved by the Bell. Lopez was a wrestler in high school and trained in both boxing, BJJ, and MMA later on. Lopez even has footage online of him sparring with the legendary champion boxer Canelo Alvarez. Lopez isn't a professional fighter like some of the other actors we've covered, but he certainly is a talented fighter. And now we have Jason Statham. Unlike Lopez, Statham is an actor who's made a name for himself more so in the current day. Statham has appeared in several different blockbuster movies over the past decade, including appearing in The Fast and the Furious alongside The Rock. Statham has also starred in films like The Expendables and is known for his great fighting scenes. Statham trains in several different fighting styles, including boxing, wrestling, BJJ, and kickboxing. Up next on our list is Aston Kutcher. Just like Lopez, Kutcher is another actor known for his work on shows of the past. Namely, Kutcher's most famous role comes from that 70s show where he played Kelso. Kutcher, however, is an insanely talented and seasoned grappler and has competed in several different BJJ competitions. He currently holds a purple belt, famously the 8th degree black belt world champion grappler Rigon Mikado claimed that Kutcher could beat Conor McGregor in a grappling match. Match. The next actor we're covering is another one who shouldn't need an introduction. Henry Cavill has portrayed several different characters over the span of his acting career. Some of his more notable works include portraying Superman and his work on The Witcher. Just like both Superman and Geralt of Rivia though, Cavill is familiar with fighting. Cavill is a frequent practitioner of BJJ and other grappling arts. He utilizes martial arts to not only maintain his impressive fitness, but to also become an overall better grappler. Now we have Jason Frank. Although you probably don't think of the Power Rangers as legitimate and competitive fighters, Frank is certainly a stunning exception to that perception. Jason Frank worked on Mighty Morphin Power Rangers as the Green Ranger. From an early age, however, Frank studied martial arts, specifically karate and BJJ. Frank is a black belt in Shotokan karate and has even had a few professional MMA fights. Frank's record stands at 4 and Oh, with two wins by knockout and two by submission. He's certainly not a pushover and can certainly put up a good fight. Another unexpected entry on this list, Taylor Lautner. Lautner's rise to stardom began with his appearance in Twilight as Jacob the Werewolf. Although the perception of him being just a pretty boy persists, Lautner is certainly no pushover. The actor is a black belt in karate and has competed at many different presentations, winning several of them. As the actor tries to define himself beyond his work on Twilight, he's begun to showcase his fighting skills more. Lautner is certainly more than just the pretty lycanthrope from Twilight. There you have it. Some actors who you probably didn't know were fighters. From actors who are also competitive, professional fighters, to people who simply don't come off as fighters like Lautner, there's a surprising amount of martial arts in Hollywood. So what do you think? Did you know any of these guys were fighters? Comment down below, like the video, and subscribe. Thanks for watching.